All right, I want Trevor today, and we're going to be uh, working on this Valor, and we just want to make sure it's an Alliance RV. We're in their final finish checkout lane here. You can see all the Valors. And we're going to go in here, and Trevor's going to show us how to make sure that it's set for lithium. We don't know if this one is, but we want to make sure. So go ahead, Trevor, and walk us through it. This is the uh, 40 amp Rover Elite. Comes with a basic solar package. What you do for programming is hit the down arrow, filter, or cycle through the screens until you see the battery symbol with the uh, voltage shown. Once you see that, hold the right button for a couple seconds. It's going to start blinking. These are your these are your battery types. You can cycle through them. There's gel, sealed, flooded, and lithium. So once you get on lithium. You hit the right button. You can also change it from 12 volt to 24 volt, but we want to keep it at 12 volt. And then once you're done, you just hold this down for a couple seconds. And I'll take you back to this, and then you can go right. to your main screen. So Trevor, why don't you tell us why it's important for us to have it lithium and 12 volt? So if we don't change that, uh, if, if it comes with a, a seal or a gel, um, when the battery dies, and uh, it's not set for lithium, then the battery will not wake up. Um, so so when it doesn't mean to wake up, it goes in a protection mode. What it does, this battery down here will be in a protection mode. Lithium has, uh, just like a car, if it's uh, if it's too low, it's gonna go in protection mode, which then it kind of shuts down the BMS in it. So that's gonna protect the battery. So to wake it up, if it's set in lithium and 12 volt, that means the solar panels can wake that battery up. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. All right. So once again, we're just... If, it, if you see an ACH come across the screen, or is it really ACT? It's trying to activate it. Uh, if you see that come across, then and it doesn't officially wake it up, then you can either try to shut up, make sure all your 12 volt is shut down, shut off your 12 volt disconnect, and then the refrigerator is on. So you could try to go inside and turn off your refrigerator because it's directly wired to your batteries. Try that and then it should wake up if it's not enough solar to... Uh... Okay, so what that means on this display here, you can see an ACT, but it looks like an ACR. And that that's one that's trying to wake up. This one's already woke up, the batteries woke up, but that means you want to shut off all your 12 volt power and you know and the solar panels are wired straight to the battery and then that allow it to wake up the battery and start charging it from dead.